My name is Karen Kerr. I am the Stenograph District Sales Manager in your area. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedules to join me today. It's never too early and it's never too late to get yourself organized, and that includes your case catalyst files. There are a number of features in Catalyst that can help you stay organized before, during, and after a job. In today's webinar, I'm going to give you an overview of Catalyst's case structure for organizing your files, the two different views and managed jobs, icon view and detailed view, how to track job states and due dates, how to quickly search file contents to find jobs or information you need, and lastly, how to take advantage of Cat Scratch to keep track of your personal notes. Let's first take a look at the Manage Jobs screen. Manage Jobs is the foundation of Case Catalyst. It allows you to organize your work the way you want it and is completely customizable to your personal preferences and work habits. Manage Jobs is essentially the file manager for Catalyst and it is completely flexible to suit your needs. The case concept is a great way to group related transcripts together to take advantage of quick and easy access to find your files, automatically selecting dictionary entries and word lists, keeping track of attorney's names or other case specific dictionary entries you've already done or notes you have made and that you want to reference from job to job. You can use the case concept to organize your files by the year and or month they were created. Grouping files this way makes it easier to locate files, backup and restore files easily, or retrieve files from cloud backup without searching through hundreds of files. There are a couple of different ways to create a new case. From the menu bar, select File, then New, then Case, or from the icon bar, select the briefcase icon. A new case will appear in Manage Jobs, and you can type the name you want for this case. For example, Jones versus Smith, or the current year and or month. You can even put a case within a case. You can get as detailed as you would like. You can drag and drop files into the case, or you can right click on the files and select move. Or you may simply want to start your real time session within a case so that you don't have to move it later. Catalyst has two types of viewing options, icon view and detailed view. You can toggle between these two views by using the icons on your toolbar or by clicking on view and selecting either icon view or detailed view. This is icon view which shows the cases and transcripts as icons and the colors indicate the different job states such as edited, proofread, printed, etc. Now let's take a look at some of the advantages of detailed view. Detailed view provides information about your jobs, such as job date, job state, and due date. The columns can be sorted in ascending or descending order by clicking on the column heading. Due date will help you keep a handle on your workflow and what jobs are due when. Job date helps you keep track of when you took the job. Job state helps you keep track of the status of each job, such as translated, final edit, proofread, final print, and other standard states. You can click on the due date to set the date that the transcript is due to be completed. There is no need to use pencil and paper or other software to keep track of your work. The highlighted file in red indicates that this particular transcript is due soon. You can also keep track of your job states by clicking on the job state and selecting from a list of options or you can customize it to your preferences. Customizing your job states and color assignments is easy to set up. You can use your own words for the job states, such as sent to scopist, invoiced, or payment received. At a glance, you will know exactly what states have been completed and what you may have left to do with the transcript. Let text and or colors be your guide. Case Catalyst pays attention to the actions you have taken and sets the job state for you. You don't need to micromanage each transcript with slips of paper, handwritten logs, or your calendar. Case Catalyst is not just a CAT system, it's a work management system. So again, it's just a matter of a preference of whether you use icon view, detailed view, or toggle between the two. It just depends on how much information you want visible on the screen at any given moment. 
Have you ever tried to find a file that you took in the past, but you weren't sure what the file name was or where it was in your managed jobs? Well, Search File Contents can easily resolve that. Search File Contents is like the Google Search of Case Catalyst. It's fast, easy, and free. Let's say months ago or even years ago, you had taken the testimony of an expert witness. Now, now you are coming across the same expert witness again in another matter, and you want to review that transcript so that you can re-familiarize yourself with the type of testimony you can expect from this expert witness. You're trying to rack your brain on when you took that previous text testimony. Or let's say you had a, done a job months ago, and now you are going on another job for that exact same case. You want to be able to review the transcript and possibly the job dictionary, but you can't remember when you took the prior job. In both of these instances, you can quickly find and access the prior transcript from the Manage Job screen by clicking on Tools, Search File Contents. When the Search File Contents dialog box opens, you will select Transcript as the file type. You are going to search for text and you will type in the text. In this example, you are going to search for Jeffrey because you know that you had an older job where he appeared and you want to get the correct spelling of his last name or of other people in that case and maybe even review the job dictionary from back then. You have the option of searching all users on your computer or only a particular user or even limit it to the contents in a particular case. In this example, you're going to search the contents of your current entire user. Once you have selected the different options, click on the search button. The results from your search appear in a pane titled Search File Contents Results. Every file that the name Jeffrey appeared in will be listed in this pane. You simply double click on one of the items and it opens up the file and takes you directly to that page and line number instantly. Once the file is open, you can look at the title bar at the very top of your screen and you can quickly see where you have the file stored. The title bar displays the current user, the case name if the file is within a case, and the file name. In this example, it, show, it is showing the user name as Sydney and that the file is inside of a case called Barry and that the file name is 81006. Now let's take a look at Cat Scratch. Cat Scratch is a dialog pane that's designed to be a virtual scratch pad. You can use Cat Scratch to help you remember spellings, attorney's orders, notes to a scopist, or anything else you may want to jot down. You can add a note, a comment, or a reminder to Cat Scratch that you would otherwise jot down on a sheet of paper. The notes remain with the job and cannot become misplaced. You can add or view the notes before, during, or after a job. To access Cat Scratch within a transcript file, click on View, Panes, Cat Scratch. You will first want to set the Cat Scratch pane scope. Click on the options icon on the Cat Scratch toolbar. You can decide whether to see these items in the Cat Scratch pane for every job you translate, only for jobs in a particular case, or only for the one job. You can insert a note by clicking in the text area of the Cat Scratch pane and then clicking on the icon that says New on the Cat Scratch toolbar and then simply type in the desired text. Again, you can add to or view your notes before, during, or after a job. Thank you again for taking the time out of your busy schedules to view my Staying Organized webinar. I hope you've learned a few tricks that will keep you organized before, during, and after a job. If you have any questions, want more information on Case Catalyst, or any of our other products, please give me a call at the number below or drop me an email. I would welcome the opportunity to, to discuss any of our products with you. Again, thank you and have a great day.